All right, guys, so if you're looking for an affordable laser engraver all-in-one that's packed with features and can do cool projects like this, then you're going to want to stay tuned to learn more about the Wayne Lux K8. What's up, guys? Welcome to the channel. So I got another cool project to share with you guys. This is the Wayne Lux K8 laser engraver slash cutter and this by far is the most affordable all-in-one laser engraver machine that i've had on my channel super pumped to share this with you guys because i think this is a really good pickup it's affordable and this wayne lux k8 is packed with features that you won't normally get with your higher end laser engravers now this k8 can be purchased in a two and a half watt five watt or a 10 watt version currently what i have right here is the five watt version here's a quick look at some of the projects that i did this is actually a bottle opener that i engraved Here's an example of the detail that you'll be able to get out of this Wayne Lux K8. And as you guys can see, it actually cut this too. So it's not only an engraver, it is also a cutter. But very nice detail. Here's a couple more projects here. Transformer emblem. You got SpongeBob there. And most of these projects are actually built in to the app that's supplied with this Wayne Lux K8 and it is called Cut Labs. So there is Captain America. We've got Optimus Prime there. Here is a Christmas, Merry Christmas 2024. Little etch I did in this glass. And a couple other projects I did with this K8 that's also built into the app are these nice little models. So this is a plane and it pre-cuts everything out of the board for you and you just pop it out and put it together there's instructions and everything and then another one i did was this helicopter so really cool especially for the kids and they have tons more of these projects on their app all right guys so you've seen some of the projects that i've done with this now let's take a closer look at this wayne lux k8 engraver so one of the really nice features of this is this is an all-in-one system there is no assembly required with this this is how it comes this is how you're going to get it and this is an enclosed laser engraver so as you guys will see on the front here you got your door on the front and then you also have a door on the back so this does have like almost a, a see-through type design and it does have a safety feature that when this laser engraver is engraving or cutting, if these doors are open, it will completely shut down or pause the project. This does have a see-through glass, as you guys can see, so you can see your project while it is being engraved or cut. All right, so when you open up the door here, you'll see your work area. Here is your laser, and it does have your little adjustment leg here that you flip down. So if you put a project in there, this is how you're going to do the focus. And on the side here is a wheel. Now this is a manual focus. So right here is the wheel and you're gonna adjust this wheel manually. Once you get your adjustment set, you're just gonna flip that back up and your focus is now set. Also right on the bottom here is a dust box. So this is pretty much just a dust tray and you can pull this out. So this is going to be a really easy way to clean up your projects. Also a premium feature with this K8 is it has a built-in camera, which makes doing projects really simple and easy. Here's a project that I did with utilizing the camera. I was able to put this bottle opener in here and then with the text, I was able to see exactly where this text was gonna line up on this bottle opener before I started the project. So that makes doing projects like these super easy and it's a really nice feature that it included with this K8. As you guys can see on this side, you have a repeat button and down here you have a power button. There's also some LEDs that's built in here that's gonna tell you the status of your engraver. Over here is a connection for an optional smoke and odor purifier and i also use that while testing out this laser engraver and 90 percent of my projects were done in my living room and i didn't have to worry about any smoke or smell 
while I was doing these projects. Usually I'm out in the garage doing these projects that's well ventilated. But with this attachment, you'll be able to do all your projects in the comfort of your home, which makes this ideal for anybody that's just getting into laser engraving or cutting that might not be able to do stuff like this in a shop. Over on the other side here, you got a USB-C connector. That's gonna be where your power goes into. Now this can be used multiple different ways. You can use it with your app that's built into your phone. You can use Cut Labs on your laptop and you can either connect this through Wi-Fi, which is gonna allow you to use the camera, or you can connect this hardwired through a USB cable. Along with Cut Labs, editing software that you get free with this, you can use laser gerbil or a light burn. All right guys, so here is the attachment that I was talking about earlier. This is going to be the smoke and odor purifier, and this is how it comes. It comes with this extendable hose that is bendable, and then you're just gonna lock it right into the side of the laser engraver, click it into place, and that's it. That's all the assembly that's required if you wanna use this purifier, which I would highly suggest if you're gonna do this in the home or office, definitely pick up this purifier, because like I said earlier, I used this in my living room with this purifier, and there was no smell, no odor, no smoke or anything like that. And it made this really convenient just to fire up and just use whenever you wanted to instead of having to go out to your shop or garage. Now the way this works is there is a filter that's built into this box. It sucks out all of the smoke and fumes, goes through the filter, and then exhausts it out the back after it's all clean. And there is three modes for this, depending on if you're cutting or engraving. It's got high, medium, and low. So to use the purifier, all you're gonna do is hit the button below, which is the power button. Right now I have it on high. I'm not really sure if you guys can hear that, but it's not really that loud. And this is as loud as it's gonna get because this is on high. Now it's on low. And most of the time when I was using this, I was using it on medium. So on low, you barely can hear this. Go ahead, kick it up to medium. And like I said, all it's doing is it's pulling the air out of the enclosure here and then pushing it through the built-in filter that's in this box and purifying the air. And then there's high again. So really simple, easy to use. And then it's got some latches on the side here to be able to take the filter out and replace it if you need to. All right guys, so I just went ahead and fired up the K8. There's the power button down there. As you guys can see, there's the indicator LEDs. And if you look right over here on the inside, it does have a nice LED light in there to help you view your project area. Now this laser engraver is a smaller laser engraver. This is a 130 millimeter by 130 millimeter engraving area. So you'll be able to do smaller projects. So this is roughly the size of the working area. You're gonna get about five inches by five inches. So like I said, 130 millimeters by 130 millimeters. So this is definitely gonna be utilized better for small projects, say coasters, the bottle opener I did, or if you wanna do these small projects like this that are pretty cool, engraves like smaller plaques, this is gonna be perfect for that. So as you guys can see, I've done a lot of projects with this Wayne Lux K8, using everything from basswood, cardstock, engraving on metal, glass, and everything seemed to come out really well. All right guys, so I got my laptop, I pulled up here and I opened up Cut Lab X. That's what it's actually called. And this is gonna be the free editing software that you'll get with your Wayne Lux. Like I said earlier, you still can use Light Burn or Laser Gerbil if those are something that you feel more comfortable with. But the cool thing with this software is it has already a bunch of projects in here that come with the program. and. Some of them are pretty cool. That's where I was able to do this airplane here and the helicopter, and they got tons more. Here is the airplane. So I went ahead and clicked on it there for you guys. And it breaks down for you how to put it together, all the cuts it's gonna make and everything. So really nice the way they put together this editing software. I was actually pretty impressed once I got used to using it. And there's tons of other projects on here. Here's a chair. There's a Spider-Man that I did right there, which was really cool. But I like these 
little projects that they have that you can actually like put together like a puzzle. Here is the helicopter. And these are really intricate too, so nice detail to them. And they all just kind of fit together after you cut everything out. Really thought this was a nice addition to this Wayne Lux. And they got six pages of this stuff. Here is a pen holder, pencil holder that you can make. Pretty cool. Like I said, shows you how to put everything together once everything is cut out. So really nice program if you want to do some projects for the kids or maybe as gifts, something like that. These are pretty cool. And then, of course, you can also do your own custom stuff. What I want to show you guys is I'm going to go ahead and connect this to my laptop and then I'll show you the camera feature. All right, guys, so the way you're going to hook this up is you can either hook this up through USB or Wi-Fi, but if you want to use the camera function, you're going to use Wi-Fi. So you're going to check your networks for the K8. It'll show up in your network settings and you'll come back to your editing software here. And let me zoom up here. At the bottom corner, you'll have Wi-Fi. You're going to switch this to USB or Wi-Fi. So there's USB, Wi-Fi. Get on Wi-Fi and then you hit connect. And as you guys can see, it turned green and it is currently connected. And that's how easy it is. So this does connect through a Wi-Fi connection between your laptop or your desktop to the Wayne Lux K8. Alright guys, so we're going to go ahead and do a project here. I got it connected. I got this little Snoopy design here and what we're going to do is I'm going to show you guys how cool the camera feature on this engraver is. So right at the top here, let me zoom up for you. You got a little icon here that activates the camera. So we're going to go ahead and click on that and then you'll be able to see what's inside the K8. I got a little circular piece of wood in there, like an oval piece. So let me move this out of the way. And there is a look at a little piece of wood I got in there. So there is the view of what's inside the K8. And I'll show you guys real quick here. So that's what's in there. This is what I want to engrave. So I got the transformer on this side. I was going to do the Snoopy on this side just to show you guys. So like I said, all you do is you're going to go ahead and put this inside your engraver on this platform. You're going to want to adjust this with the kick down leg. So we'll go ahead and do that. So let me zoom up for you guys. So there is my basswood in there. I got the leg kicked down. So the focus is set where it should be. I'm going to go ahead and kick that back up. We'll put this in the middle. Kind of square it up. And I want to show you guys another accessories that this comes with. They call this the L-shaped locator. But this has magnets and little areas of pins on the back. So if you want to do multiple projects, you can go ahead and put this in here. And this is going to be a guide. It's going to lock into place. So now you can do multiple projects if you want to by using that L-bracket that's going to hold your project in place. So a really nice accessory there. If you decide to say you want to do more than one of these keychains, go ahead, throw that in there, locks it into place, holds it into place, and now you're ready to go if you just want to constantly repeat that project. So I'll go ahead and close the door. All right, so now that we got everything lined up in the K8, I'm going to go back up to the top here because we move stuff around, take another picture. So there is the updated picture. And then I'm going to take this Snoopy. I'm going to drag it down to size. Let me zoom up a little bit. I'm going to take this Snoopy. I'll move it. And as you guys see, as I click onto it, it now just shows the lines, which is cool. So obviously that's a little bit too big. 
We'll downsize it there. And this is what makes this really, really nice. For the price that this Wayne Lux K8 is for it to pack all these features is really amazing actually. And it works really well. So I got it centered up there and pretty much that's it, we're done. And now we can just go ahead and start our project. Now over on the side, you can change all of your settings here as far as how many passes. You can add layers, take away layers. You can do cuts, you can do just engraving and you can change the power. So here are some of the settings. You got your speed here, engraving times, your maximum power, and this can all be changed. And then you can also add layers. So if you wanted to add cut layers or more engraving, you can also do that and customize them. But just using the camera with this is really a nice touch with this Wayne Lux K8. It makes just using this really, really easy so you can visualize what your project's gonna look like. So we'll go ahead and I got everything set up. So now when I hit start, it's gonna transfer this to the Wayne Lux K8, so it's gonna upload the file. So we'll hit start here, and it started engraving. So you got the blue light here that's saying that it's engraving, and I don't know if you guys can see that, but the laser is currently engraving, and this isn't gonna take long at all. This is all in real time right now. Try to get out of the reflection there. And like I said, this is the five watt laser that's in this, but you can get a two and a half watt version or the 10 watt version. I'll go ahead and show you the safety design here. If you open this, it stops. So really it just paused engraving you guys can see, I don't know if you guys seen the smoke that came out of there because I currently do not have the purifier on. As soon as we close this, it's going to start engraving where it left off. So really nice feature. It's got the door on the front, the door on the back. So right now I'm out in my garage. I'm not going to use the purifier, no need to. Also, it does have a load bar down here on the project editing software here so it lets you know how far the project is completed it's almost done like I said we're doing this all in real time so it's finished go ahead and open this up and we'll see what it looks like so there's a look at the finished project, a little Snoopy. And like I said, really nice to be able to use that camera feature to be able to center this. Also with the camera feature, it does have a preview. So what it'll do is it'll actually draw a square in on your project to let you know exactly where the engraving is gonna be. So if you're not using the camera feature. So what do I think about the Wayne Lux K8 laser engraver well i think this is a great affordable way to get into laser engraving whether you're a first timer or you've been doing laser engraving for a while now with this k8 no assembly required it's all enclosed it's got the built-in camera you can get the optional purifier and this does also have an attachment for a rotary tool if you want to do tumblers glasses anything like that but the fact of all these features that's packed into this wayne lux k8 i think this is great for the hobbyist that wants to do small projects, maybe inside their house, in their basement, office. Maybe they don't have a shop or they don't want to do a lot of projects. Right now on Amazon, you can pick this up for around $400. That's a really affordable for what you're getting here and all the features that's packed into this. So if this laser engraver is something that you're interested, I got links in the description box below. Go ahead and check out those links. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Hopefully you guys found some value in this video. If you did, smash that like button. If you like what I'm doing on my channel, make sure you subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Until the next one, guys, I will talk to you later.